So, 1.20 was kind of empty, so I'm gonna rank everything in it. But before I get into the bad, let's start with the good. Cherry Groove Biomes. If you're saying this is one of the worst parts of the update, you're joking. This biome is like one of the best parts of this update. It's like amazing. Animals are okay. They're like just. They're really slow on their jumps, kind of fast, but overall they're not that good of a mob, but they're pretty cool in the desert. Sniffers are 100% one of the most disappointing parts of the update. Like, all I can really do is, like, get these torch flowers. They don't even look that good, to be honest. Uh, yeah, and I can just drop, like, these pitcher pods. I don't even know what these are for, actually. But, yeah, it's, like, a really bad part of the update. I guess rafts are kind of cool. Like, they're kind of nice. Okay, archaeology was, like, the main selling point of this update. And this update is absolute, like, the archaeology part of it is absolute dog water. Like, okay, armor trims is by far one of the best parts of this update. It's like, adds a lot of end game content. It just makes your armor look so much better. But I wish you could actually put on elytras, but you got capes, so it's not really that big of a deal. But this armor trim is so good, it adds more end game content to the actual game. And yeah, it's just epic. One other cool feature that makes mo clicking mob heads a lot more uh, cooler is like they'll play the sound. That skeleton, zombie, creeper, piglin, ender dragon, and the wither skeleton. Uh, it's actually kind of cool, so it makes um, clicking mob heads a lot cooler. And if you want just like the sounds, maybe to scare your friends or something, this would be a good way. Uh, also, a really nice feature is um, you can now have like banners on shields. So the creative UI got a revamp. Like, uh, there's new options on the bottoms, like just telling you everything you need to get so you can quickly get it. It's actually a lot better. One sad thing about this update is the netherite nerf. Right now, you need like um. You need like a smithing template which costs like 7 diamonds or you could find one that duplicate it. So Bedrock Edition also added um, the trapdoor feature which like pushes you down. Uh, they should have added that ages ago actually but it's good that they added it now. Hello camel. So there's a couple of extra things I want to talk about. Basically Mojang has announced a Minecraft Live for October 15th. I'm actually really excited and there's a mob vote. Minecraft community don't fail us please like if you fail us. I have no faith in the Minecraft community ever again. If you want to see how to join random Minecraft servers, click on the video in the top right of the screen and I'll see you there.